God is for you. Do you believe that? I'm Danny Sinnott with another Brave to Go. It can be hard to believe that when we're wading through the tough stuff, can't it? But God never promised that life would be easy. He didn't say, follow me and all your problems will disappear in a puff of smoke. He didn't hand you a chocolate and say, have a break, have a Kit Kat, although chocolate's always a good option. Actually, Jesus was very honest when he spoke about life. He said, in this world you will have trouble, but take heart, I've overcome the world. No, God says, I have not given you a spirit of fear, but of love and power and of a sound mind. God is love, and if you'll choose to believe that God is who he says he is and cling to him, you'll always find hope. God will use your greatest trials and your biggest mess for your greatest message. You know, when I lost my firstborn son, Jackson, it was the worst experience of my life. I wouldn't wish the loss of a child on anyone, not even my worst enemy, not that I have any, but the amount of people that I've been able to help around the world to minister and mentor and do life together with because of that loss has shown me that God's plan is bigger than our pain. Jackson's death was not in vain and I'll see Jackson again in heaven. It's a huge honour and a blessing to be able to speak into the life of another and it brings healing and peace and joy. In Jeremiah chapter 29 11 it says, I know the plans I have for you, declares the Lord, plans to prosper you and not to harm you, plans to give you hope and a future. God is for you. Believe that. Braveenough.org.